Okay, I'm gonna try something else. What do I say when they open up the door? Hello guys, it's Ashley and welcome to my room tour. This is my room. I currently live in New York City. I live in Manhattan and I right now <laughs> live in a house. <laughs> And <laughs> okay, great. That's a great clip. Okay, anyways. I currently live in a house with four other roommates. We all split rent of one apartment unit. And this is my bedroom. I live in the master bedroom and I've lived here for about seven months. My rent, can you guys guess my rent? Guess it right now and see if you're right. And I'll tell you at the end. I've been living here for a minute and I've Finally, finally, finally have decorated it to my liking. I also have my boyfriend, Kelly, behind the camera for Extra Dynamic. Hi, Kelly. I'm busy. Hey, you can talk in it if you want. Oh, I didn't know that. You can talk the entire time. You Let's could just talk. do the tour. <laughs> pause, pause. We gotta go back out to my room. So first thing that you guys see when you come into my room are probably my millions of bags that are up on the wall. Here I have all my black bags. These are some of my go-tos because they're just like very simple. If you come on in, you can see my tote bag collection. I have quite too many tote bags. We have Trader Joe's. Extra dynamic, Kasubi, bunch of them. Bunch of different variations and options of interesting tote bags. Hoarder. I'm not a hoarder. I just have a collection. It's a collection. Anyways, more tote bags, really fun. Makes my room look a little bit messy. I'm really not a minimalist type of girl. I'm more of like a eccentric, lots of colors, a little bit messy. <laughs> and we have even more bags right here. This bag, my lovely boyfriend gave to me for my birthday, my 23rd birthday. Thank you. Hat, more bags, more bags, more bags, and more bags. And look at all of these. Some of these are actually from you guys. Some of you guys gave me some little notes, and so I have them right in here. Look, someone gave this to me to WeWork. Ashley, I'm a big fan. You seem busy, but I want to say hi. And they slid it to me like while I was just sitting at a desk. Some of these like came in the mail, and I just have other little notes from my life. I have my jewelry collection. <laughs> the jewelry. DJ Cohen says the jewelry. Anyways, and then I have my closet, like I said, with all of my clothes. This is a really interesting closet because there is no door. So like every day I have to look at my closet, which like I personally don't love because then you like see all the mess everywhere. However, that does make me keep my closet more clean, I think. So it's kind of helpful in a way. Fake, 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 fake. Hey, no, this is real. I could have cleaned this up. It's usually covered. I don't know about that. I think you're lying. Anyways, I have this little stool right here and I'm going to now show you how I organize my closet and some of my favorite pieces. These are all of my sweatshirts and sweaters. These are all of my hoodies. Then I have bedding, random stuff, more sweatshirts, jackets, and then I have dresses. These are my dresses, tank tops, etc. More tank tops, short sleeves, long sleeves. And now let me show you my favorite items in my closet. Hmm. Oh, also guys, I'm using a mic today. You guys are listening from, oh, this. You can see it's right here. So I'm talking into it. I never used these, but I thought it'd be really cool and really fancy if I did it. So also I'm starting a new ASMR channel. It's on my Instagram at AAAshleyK. AAAshleyK ASMR. One of my favorites right now that I've been wearing every day is this bomber jacket that I got on Depop. Super epic. Oh, Kelly, I never showed you this, but look what I got on ThreadUp. Uh. <laughs> well, I love sparkles, and that's why I was a competitive cheerleader for eight years. It's just because I like sparkles. And then my other favorite clothing items to wear, which I have a few of all the same, are the divinity like a romper jumpsuits from Maritzia. These are my favorite. These look so good. Kelly is nodding because he loves them. And same, I also love them. Look, I got these shoes in Sweden and I have not worn them yet, but they're like a pretty epic collab. I sound like Andrew. Awake times Asics. My cowboy boots that Issa gave me. I love these. Come kind of bussin'. Anyways, let's look in the bathroom. This is my beautiful bathroom. Um, I actually share my room with my boyfriend, Kelly, who you can see in the mirror. Don't say that. 
What, that we share a room? That we share a bathroom? They don't know. Okay, anyways, this is Kelly's side of the sink, and this is my side of the sink. Holy in the shot. It's fine, just get in the shot. Also, I'm, I'm crunching on something under my shoe. Oh, oh, it's your dignity. <laughs> because you're not filming like a professional, and that's your job, so talk to me later. Anyways. Well, I'm actually not pro. What? Anyways, why don't I give you a little haul of what's on my counter. I keep all my jewelry here because like I take it off and then I like don't feel like putting it away. So it's on this little marble thing from CB2. I got it on sale though, trust. And then I have all my little skincare items. We have a bunch of Crave Beauty, Drunk Elephant, Neutrogena, Kinship. You know, I always use my Gucci perfume, but recently I've been using Flower Bomb, Ruby Orchard from Victor and Rolf. I have my little laundry basket over here. For some reason, my sweatpants that are like part of the set, I always get dirty. Like something about it, I'm like a magnet to dirtiness. I got a smoothie on it. And last time when I was at home, I sat on chocolate. And Kelly goes, what's on your butt? And I go, oh. And I had a big chocolate stain, looked like a poop stain. Mm -hmm. Me and my mom took us like four washes to get it out, but those sweatpants, something about them. Love to get them dirty. My toilet behind the door, look at this. What the heck, who designed this? Literally like, who is designing this? It's like literally if I'm like sitting on the toilet and you come in, it's like, bam, my knees. Ooh, oh, oh my God, double ACL meniscus MCL tear. Now I have to wear one of those things on my leg for the rest of my life. Every girl does. Here I have all of my junk, like really epic. We have junk, 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 and junk. And sometimes I mix this with water and I put it in my armpit to try to make my armpits uh, not smell as bad. So, and I think it works. Me and Amber always joke that we look like frogs if you put Good this on. Spilling. What? Oh. <laughs> Okay. Dance break! Dance break! What if I just like started like being like really good at break dancing like this? <laughs> they look cool? Yeah. <laughs> I actually feel like the shower is really nice. The interior of this entire bathroom is definitely giving like manly bachelor pad vibes, but that's okay. I like it. I like the wood and I like the dark granite more than like a fully white type of like vibe. I don't know. It has a little more character. Then in here we have Kelly's side. Um, towels, toenail clipper, toilet paper, extra merch, uh, the essentials as they say. <laughs> I have a couple mirrors in my room. Here's the first mirror. Look, I did the turkey trot. I won the turkey trot because I ran, uh, how many Ks was it, 5K? Yeah, I think it was a 5K. Uh, I ran it in 14 minutes. Oh, and this is from the one time that I climbed Mount Everest. So yeah. Okay, and now this is what you guys have all been waiting for, the main area of my room. Let's start over here in this corner. We have my earmuff collection. These are all from MEJ. They are the cutest little earmuffs ever with little stars on them. Since it's always cold here, we gotta have the winter essentials. So scarf, earmuffs. I keep all my hair clips here like this. Um, I keep my good luck hot air balloon that Kelly gave me. All of my necklaces, silver necklaces, pearl necklaces are behind here. Most of these are from Remore, which is like one of my favorite jewelry brands, sunglasses, accessories, and whatnot. And then here is my desk. So my desk, I have my laptop. I have my planner. I have a random suitcase I do not know where to put. Chair from Amazon. The desk is from West Elm. And then I have this beautiful art around my room that is made by Kelly's brother, Wakasi Art. Follow him on Instagram. Go commission a piece. Get someone for your room, for your house for your work. Anyways, he made these beautiful like resin flowers for me. They are beautiful. So I have one here, also over here above my bag. Um, and then I have also my 1 million subscriber plaque. You gotta love it. My 100K plaque is back at home, upstate. So, and then over here, we have this beautiful shelf. This was actually Kelly's idea, but it did not come like this. This is actually a dresser. This dresser is from CB2. And then on top of it, Kelly got me this shelf, I think for Christmas. He's shaking his head. It was for Christmas. What was it for? Just for fun. Then what did you give me for Christmas in 2021? Trip to Cancun. Oh yeah, you're right. Got this beautiful shelf from Kelly, which he built for me. Gotta love a handyman. Anyways, it's on top of a mouse pad. If you look closely that I put on top of this dresser, because if you like put it next to each other, it's just like taking up too much room. So we put it all together and it has all of my camera equipment. As you guys know, I do YouTube as my job 
full time. So I do in fact have quite a lot of camera equipment. Not as much as Kelly, but I do have my fair share of camera gear. Kelly always makes fun of me for like how I literally manhandle my camera. I just realized I did that. Anyways. Why are you comparing your cameras to mine? Like it's not like a competition. Well, just because, well, I just think, well, <laughs> I was just saying for fun, like you have a lot of camera gear. I don't have as much camera gear. All YouTubers are different. I don't know what a lot of camera things mean. I don't know how anything works. I just put it on auto and I pray for the best. Don't worry guys, you don't need to know that much about cameras to do YouTube. However, you do, I feel like I know like a good amount. This is one of my favorite lenses. It is a 16 to 35 millimeter lens. Right now, filming on Kelly's camera actually, so slightly different, but this is my camera. Look at it, Sony a7C, 16 to 50 millimeter pancake lens. Good for vlogging, go like this. And I always use a Sony camera, period. And then my mic is on really crooked, dual ended mic. So if you talk on this side, it picks up. If you talk on this side, it picks up. It's pretty cool. I have other goodies here. Bikies, fake plants from Ikea, a Himalayan sea salt lamp. Um, look at this beautiful beautiful portrait that Kelly drew of me. Isn't it so beautiful? And look at this picture of us. This is like literally probably the second day that we ever met. Ashley and Kelly, September 2021. It's beautiful. My mom sent it to us because she shipped us. She shipped Cashly and she literally shipped it to us. Yeah, you're right. I'll follow Cashly on Instagram at K A A Ashley. Then I have some little notes from my friends and one of my favorite artwork from one of my favorite artists. She makes really cute little artworks and I have one here as well as over here. This one is my favorite ever. This one is so cute. Kelly and I have little inside jokes about it. Then here, this I feel like is like when you come in my room, your eyes just go BAM. Look at this. This is the most beautiful art piece ever, once again, by Kelly's brother, Casey Wakasi. But it's two koi fish. Yeah, and every time when people come in my room, they go where did you get that? And I say, my boyfriend's brother made it for me. I have a lot of fake plants in my room. I have no real plants. And if I do have real plants, they're all dead. I will unfortunately show you my dead plant collection. Uh, I haven't actually watered these in, since we moved here because we left for like a couple months and I was like, you know what? It's past the point of me being able to resuscitate them. We didn't leave for a couple months. Well, like we would leave for a couple weeks at a time. Two weeks Like, like multiple times in a row and then like. No, no, no. That's they'd not They'd just be excuse. dying. That's my, I got you this bond. Yeah, treat. and it's still alive. Yeah. And it's still alive. As I was saying, I want to tell you guys like where things in my room are from so that you can get them for yourself. I think I forgot to say, but this shelf is from Amazon, I believe. This little guy is Queer Eye X Walmart collab. Holds all my extra clothes. So I have like my shorts random shirts, skirts, etc. in here. Kind of hides my stuff, but it looks really cute. All my fake plants for the most part are from West Elm. Some are from CB2, but I think West Elm has the superior fake plants in my opinion. Then this lamp right here is from Ikea. Gotta love it. I have uh, random crystals. This is uh, my selenite rod. I don't know anything about crystals, but one time I just bought this because I thought it was like really funny. That's like so cubular and really big. I got this cat in Turkey, it's blue, and I think I paid like $50 for it, and then I had to carry it around for two weeks, and it was worth it, and it's so adorable, and we, I never named it. Uh, I guess I'll name him Turkey. Then here is my Christmas corner. Christmas corner, yeah, 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 Christmas corner. Um, I don't know what to do with that, so it's just been there, but I have this little shelf right here. The shelf itself is from Urban Outfitters, and then I have just like a bunch of little trinkets on there. Really fun, I have some cute, adorable Polaroids. This Polaroid is me and Kelly's first picture together that we ever have taken. It's from Times Square. Look at us, look at Kelly in his fitted cap. And do it excites t-shirt. Look at that. And then there's me and Kelly last July. Then I got me some little purple candles, record player, little books, all that jazz. This lamp right here is from Bright Tech. I love it. I feel like it's so funky and so cool. And then this is my velvet chair. And here's my donut. Uh, I got my donut recently and uh, I put it right there because I thought it was good. I thought it was a good place for it. I got this on Etsy. This is from Anthropology. <laughs> It's really squishy. And then I sit like this on my chair uh, where I spend every morning and I read a book and I sip my tea just like this. And I look out the window at the beautiful view of the New York City skyline. You know, sometimes, and then when it rains and it's cloudy and it looks like you're in the clouds. It's beautiful and I love New York City. And I look at the building that blocks all of the sunlight to my house. Anyways, this is my rug, it's from 
West Elm. I feel like my room is like pretty bigly sized. Spacious. That's the word. I feel like my room is pretty spacious, so I kind of have this area that I like literally never go in. If you couldn't tell, I actually was lying about sitting in that chair. How about I do push up like Hasbula? This is my mirror. It's from Anthropology. I actually got it on sale. It's like literally the heaviest mirror I've ever experienced in my life. I cannot pick it up, but it's beautiful. Ornate. Fake plant. Whoa, are you guys seeing this? Are you seeing this right now? It's floating! Ah! Kelly got me this, and it's really cool, and it spins. Look at the power of magnetism. Then I have my little book collection right here. All the essentials. <laughs> Kelly has a hatch, which like turns on, and it does like a little sunlight thing. Kelly's melatonin. I don't take melatonin because one time, the one time that I did take melatonin, I uh, had a really bad dream where I fully accepted that I died. And then I woke up. This is my bed. This little like fuzzy blanket set is from Anthropology. Love Anthropology home stuff. And Kelly every night goes to bed with only, see this like flat sheet? Like I think only boys sleep with this because I don't even put this on my bed normally. I usually put the comforter because like who, like what is the point of that sheet? Like I have no idea. Kelly sleeps with it because he's so warm when he goes to bed. And when I go to bed, I go to bed with everything and the fuzzy blanket. And we really clash, we really clash when we go to sleep. So if anyone has any advice on how to fix our difference in body temperature, please let me know because it affects our relationship. It causes fights. No, it doesn't, but imagine. Now here's my babies. Kelly got me ready for my birthday because I'm ready is named ready because she is a red panda and she's so beautiful and like really feels sturdy which i really admire in a stuffed animal and then i got this for kelly for his birthday thought it was gonna be the same size as ready but i was mistaken and it's a cheetah so kelly what did what did you name it cheaty cheaty of course because it needs to go along with ready uh and then over there uh, there's machi like literally we're always like sorry machi like i feel so bad but it's named machi because it's a matcha cat in a burrito yep okay then this beautiful wall art i guess you would call it i got on etsy i will try to like link everything that i can in my description for you guys so you can find it but it's just like a piece of wood with yarn it's super light so god forbid if it falls on my face while i'm sleeping it's like not gonna kill me but like it'll probably still hurt but like it's not gonna kill me at least you know that's the vibes okay and then over here i have my little beautiful mushroom lamp this one is from bright tech this little lamp right here is also from Bright Tech. They were kind enough to like just send them to me. I was so happy and they sent me a little mushroom. It makes me so happy. I have a little sloth. Sometimes I put my rings on him when I go to bed. You know sometimes when like your fingers expand at night, I swear. But look at beautiful little rings and I go, you take my hand in marriage? I do. Over here, I have my little cubby. Once again, another Wakasi artwork right here. All my essentials, ketchup packets. Specifically, I kind of like the Sir Kensington's ketchup packets. Hand warmers, these New York City essential, like for real, or else I die. Uh, got my BB Simmons belt. My BB belt that my brother gave me. Pretty much my favorite possession that I own. Like if actually, if I had to choose something from my closet earlier, I would have chosen this. Pretty fire. I like how all my favorite items are like Southern, like the cowboy boots and this, you know, scrunchies. And look at this, Kelly, you made me this for Valentine's Day. You made a little coupon book. And actually like, this is incredibly artistic. So cute. So you made me little coupons. It's literally so cute. Then I have my cubby system, whack-a-mole cubby system, where I keep all of my extra belongings. These are like literally my Pilates outfits, my like really interesting like little one piece items. Next drawer, I have all of like my bikinis, which pretty much, actually all of my bikinis pretty much like exclusively are from Black Bow. This is so cute. It's my dream to do a collab with them. So, oh, my leg warmer and fuzzy sock collection. I'm a leg warmer girl. Yeah, that's really it. Uh, Oh, oh, don't ever do that ever again. This bed frame is from CB2. I forgot to say that. Uh, I like it, but sometimes I hit my ankles on it. I'm not gonna lie. But it is a beautiful walnut wood bed frame that will last me years and years and years. Look at it. It's so regal. It's so beautiful and modern. And yeah, I think that that is my entire room tour. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Oh, what was I gonna say at the end? I was gonna say how much my rent is, right? My rent is 3600 
which I will say, I think is a very fair price for being in Manhattan, having such a, such a spacious room. And I'm sure that you guys have seen like the kitchen and like we have a backyard and all of this outdoor space, washer dryer. So I feel like we have a pretty affordable apartment. We have a lot of bang for our buck for having such a nice place just because we split it with so many roommates. I think that that's what kind of makes the cost go down per person. I love it here. Thank you guys for watching. Stay extra dynamic. Kelly is extra dynamic right now, literally being behind the camera. I love you. Uh, follow me on Instagram because I think I'm gonna do a giveaway for my merch. So if you wanna be part of that, follow me there. All right guys, make sure to double tap the like button, double tap the subscribe button. And of course, make sure to click confirm and it asks you to unsubscribe. And I will see you guys next time. Peace. Oh, hey, look at this. This is me behind the camera now, but look, a piece of hair. <laughs> I cut off some of my hair yesterday.